Hey everyone, it's David Premer here. And what I wanted to do today was something a little different than what I usually do. This is just something I've been thinking about for a little while and I wanted to share it as a thought with the rest of you sellers out there, which is this concept of unconscious selling. You know, I have connected with a whole lot of sellers in my career and in my practice, as well as lots of people who would not classify themselves as traditional sellers, but they do a lot of selling in their job. And what I found is that there's this concept of unconscious selling, meaning there's a lot of people out there that are engaging in all sorts of sales tactics that work, some work, some don't, but whether they work or whether they don't, they don't know why. They don't know why they're working or why they're not working, right? And the problem with that is that if you are an unconsciously good seller, and a shout out to my sister Elise, who's an amazing unconsciously good seller. She's a great salesperson. She does a lot of selling in her job, which is not officially sales, but she doesn't know why. She doesn't know why what she's doing is so good and why it's working. And the problem with that is that you're missing an opportunity. You're missing an opportunity to really understand what you're doing and double down on the things that are working so you can keep doing more of them. On the flip side, I've seen a lot of unconsciously bad sellers. And the problem with unconsciously bad sellers is twofold. Number one, they are not good at what they do. They're not producing the numbers. They're not producing the revenue and the output and the outcome that they're hoping for. But worst of all, they tend to ruin it for the rest of us, right? They do and engage in tactics and engage with customers in a way that turns them off. And then what happens is the general community has a negative perception of what it's like to be a seller, which hurts. It hurts the rest of us. Those of us who have chosen sales as our chosen profession and who are passionate about it, who go out there every day. So my advice to you today is ask why. Ask why. Don't be an unconscious seller. Ask yourself when you're doing what you're doing and it's working. Ask yourself why it's working. And if it's not working, ask yourself why it's not working and change it up. You'll be amazed at how, <laughs> how incredible simply just asking that question, why, will improve your sales game. See you next time.